Russian sea life, you know, those kinds of things. I, I put them on at night so often and just go, I just fall straight asleep. On Netflix, there is a film show thing that basically is just like relaxing music with the visuals of under the sea and sea life. There's no talking, it's literally just watching the fish and the ocean the ocean and um, I'll show you here uh, where it is. It's called Ocean Wonders. Relax and be astonished as footage from beneath the world's oceans brings coral reefs, seahorses, and anemones. Anemones. I nearly said that weird. And other undersea marvels to your screen. So basically it's an how long is it? An hour and twenty three minutes. Um, with just this really soft music and footage of sea life. So let me just look fast forward a bit and just show you. Basically goes through like this. So it goes through in different scenes. I just find it so relaxing seeing the sea life and also the movement of things underwater. It's so kind of slow motion. Do you know what I mean? It just moves so softly. And the colours and everything are so gorgeous. Like putting this on, getting into bed all snuggly with a cup of tea. It's just so comforting. And yeah, I just think this is such a wonderful idea for a uh, thing to be on Netflix, you know, it's an unusual choice for Netflix to do. It's kind of like ASMR, but on Netflix. Um, so yeah, as I said, it's called Ocean Wonders. Ocean Wonders. I hope they do more things like this in the future. You can see here, as I just fast forward, all the different, like jellyfish. I'm not gonna ruin it, like, you know, play it all, obviously. I'm sure copyright would have issues, but <laughs> uh, you can get a basic idea. It's just really good, and I recommend checking it out. I watched it the other day, not the whole thing, because I fell asleep, um, <laughs> which shows it works. But it's such a good idea because it's the kind of thing I love. You know, you turn all the lights off, you put it on, and you just watch it till you fall asleep. I still love watching Blue Planet and shark documentaries and things like that to fall asleep, but I've seen them all. I swear to God, I've seen them all. <laughs> so it's just nice to have something that's like, you feel like you won't have watched the whole thing. Um, so that's something I definitely recommend checking out if it's your kind of uh, thing that you like. Definitely works for me anyway. I'll have a sip of my tea. Oh, it's so good. This one's actually quite sweet, even though there's no sugar in it or anything. Just naturally quite sweet. A little thing that I do to relax. Is play a certain game. There's actually two different games I play, but the main one specifically Animal Crossing New Leaf on Nintendo DS, 3DS. It is my go-to game to go to sleep. Um, so I'm going to be doing a little bit of gameplay now with the button and the controller sounds which I hope helps you relax and I'll show you why it's so relaxing to me. So I was looking through my games and I'm looking for my Animal Crossing New Leaf game which is the latest one and I spotted this which is the one and I just thought I have to go on this and see um, what my world is looking like um, and also explain to you guys what's so amazing about Animal Crossing. <laughs> but yeah, this is not the latest one, it's the one before. Um, but you guys have seen the my progress on New Leaf, but you've never seen this one, so I thought I'd go on this instead just to change it up a bit. But yeah, this is the original Animal Crossing game for DS. Um, I named my world Paradise. <laughs> my hair is pink, Mohican style. I think I have the hairdressers on this 
also a really relaxing game. I'm not going to do a gameplay on it right now. I have done in the past. Uh, just because this video is going to go on forever. Those, you guys, are all of the things that I do to help me relax and calm down and sleep. Get no sleep, snoozy. for a lot of people so thanks so much for watching you guys and hope you found it relaxing